They sign an agreement between enemy and Ministry of Health that there will be relativity between doctors, remuneration, and other health professionals and workers. Without the input of other health professionals and workers, is it done? Do you scrape somebody's health in, abs head in absence? It's not done anywhere in the world. If they have any agreement with Ministry of Health, that is their own agreement. Mm -hmm. It does not affect us. The threat they are putting to government is that the moment they are just ours, that is for other health professionals and workers, they are going to go on strike. Were we there when they had such agreement? Is it fair for Minister of Labor or Minister of Health to do such? Is that representing government accurately? No, why, why are they trying to do that? Why would they go on strike because your salaries have been increased? What has that to do with I that? wonder. I wonder. When did they give any reason for that? Uh, what? <laughs> the best is known to them, but what we, had, we, we know is that uh, it will not be taken from their own salaries to pay health workers. Okay. So, Johesu is made up of every other person in the health sector uh, yeah. apart from the doctor. Apart from yes. the doctor. Yes. Well, okay, hold on. Then is I've there also anywhere, said something. Now, hold on, yeah. Mr. Okay. David, hold on. Is there anywhere in the world where doctors and health, other health workers earn the same? Um, where all over the world, um, when there is a uh, ministry of establishment, they have different names in different countries. We call it ministry of establishment, and it's headed by the head of service. They do job evaluation, and they determine remuneration. And one major factor is duration of training that they consider. Mm -hmm. okay. And that they have been doing. Huh? But unfortunately, even the last job evaluation that was done in the health sector in Nigeria, that was 2009, the job evaluation favors some other health professionals better than the doctors such up to such today. As, such as? Like medical lab scientists. Okay. And up to today, are that they, job evaluation they, is not being used. Are they on call? And they the way use, doctors are on call? Even medical lab scientists started call duty in Nigeria before doctors. Mm -hmm. We started called, I'm a medical lab scientist, and in Nigeria, medical lab scientists started call duty before doctors, and we started any call duty allowance before doctors. The question I asked was, Strange. which you did not answer was, okay. is there anywhere in the world where doctors earn the same salary as other health workers? What is obtainable, like, if you look at, like, America, they work hourly, depending on they agree remuneration. I didn't ask how, how they work. Where? Do they earn the same? It depends on your negotiating power. Okay. It depends on your negotiating power. In fact, in the US, it's like nurses even earn more than most other professionals in the US. But there's a minimum, a kind of like mm. minimum wage that mm. cuts across. Mm. That there's a minimum wage that cuts across. I think in America, it's based on hours. Mm. And it's yeah, not... Remuneration per hour for the nurse cannot be the same as remuneration per hour for the doctor. Well, it depends. If the nurse is the consultant in that field, they can hand equally. So it depends on, if you are talking of a newly graduated nurse, they can hand the same thing. But if you are talking of a nurse who is the consultant in his or her field, can, I mean, can hand as much as a doctor. Yes. Okay, let me come to you, Mr. Dinka. What would you prefer? Because the government's still talking about um, limited resources, money now available, and there's so many demands, so many things calling for attention. What would you prefer? That the government fixes the infrastructure, the hospital environment or the places where you do your work, provide all the equipment as modern as they are, provide power, or your wages and remuneration? Thank you very much. That's 22. Uh, I will prefer, because you direct the question to me, that which one will I prefer? I will prefer that the government fixes the infrastructures and give me a livable wage. Because if you pay me poorly hmm, and you have infrastructures there, it is man that is behind every infrastructure. So the productivity will be low. But if you pay me well, and you are treating me like, okay, I am important 
in that industry, you are going to have the best of me. Okay. Now, um, how far have your negotiations gone with government? As in, do we see any light at the end of the tunnel? Well, As in, how long do we envisage this strike is going to last? The truth is that the negotiation has been interesting. Government is willing to do the appropriate, I mean, to, to yes. do the needful. The only fear the government has is the enemy that is threatening to go on strike the moment they are just for Joesu members. And what the question I always ask enemy, was there any representative of Joesu when enemy and Minister of Health were signing relativity? Can you, is it fair for government, I mean, for Minister of Health and Labor to go and sign an agreement with enemy without any representative of Joesu on parity, I mean, on, uh, on disparity that they call relativity? Is that right? Is that fair? How can you determine my remuneration in my absence with another body who is not even a union? NMA is not a union, it's, it's an, a professional association. And they are, they are sitting with government to, to discuss remuneration. It's not even right, according to labor law. Okay, talking about labor laws, there is an industrial court. Have you looked at going to the court? I mean, instead of going on strike, have you okay. thought about I seeking like legal, legal action as regards this impasse? Yes, uh, severally, Joshua uh, has been to industrial court and many uh, court judgments have been won in favor of Joshua that are still awaiting implementation. implementation. Okay. Let you me okay. For that. Yeah. yeah. I'll tell you today we have nine judgment in favor of Joesu. Mm -hmm. Nine. Nine, yes, in favor of Joesu. And none and of them have been appealed. None are, in fact, the recent appeal, eighth of May. Appeal called throughout one that has been appealed on the eighth of May, on the ground that it is baseless. And all of these judgment, there is no stay of execution for those who understand legal procedure. There is no stay of execution on any of the judgment. And in fact, there was a particular case, the one in Joss, for medical lab scientists against pathologists. And they went on appeal. I mean, they went, they asked for, the enemy asked for stay of execution. The court did not grant them stay of execution. But the Minister of Health, last year was in loot and he told the dressing leadership in loot that even though we have all those judgments we will continue to work under pathologies is that how a fair commission i mean minister should operate is that how he should operate the health sector when we have nine judgments nine judgments without stay of execution and they refuse is that not impunity impunity of the highest order in the health sector because the minister and the junior minister they are buyers is unfortunate because uh, they are medical doctors right? yes yeah, they are just taking care of their colleagues while others are suffering i mean okay 